Hey guys, it's Esther Moreno here and I love Kidman. And if you're watching this, I know you do too. So what's one way to be successful in children's ministry? Well, I wanna share with you one of those ways and that is understanding the times. I believe there are four things that we need to understand when it comes to leading and developing a thriving children's ministry. Number one, we need to understand our audience. So do you know the families that you minister to week after week? Consider examining the resources available to you within your own church. Look at the data to gain a better understanding of the different family dynamics of the children in your ministry. Also, consider visiting your local children's services agency to get a better understanding of the needs around your church so that you can better serve the families in your community. Remember, as Hosea 4 puts it, our people perish from a lack of knowledge, so make sure that you get informed. Number two, understand the challenges to your influence, guys. Are you someone who leans heavily on your title to get things done? These days, when it comes to titles, we're not in charge as much as we used to be. Now, does a title give you authority? Yes, but it's the lowest level of authority. In today's Kidman world, it's all about being an influencer. So how do you become a true influencer? Well, in the words of Theodore Roosevelt, people don't care about how much you know until they know how much you care. Reflect on some ways that you can show people in your children's ministry how much you value and care about them. Now, it's probably going to be a time investment, but it will pay dividends in the future. Remember, you have got to earn the right to get a call back. You have to earn the right to get parents to do what you ask of them. You have to earn the right to have kids receive you as a valid source. Hey, the more accepted you are by a child, the more open he or she will be to instruction. And you guys, the same is true for volunteers, parents, and church leadership. So choose to be more than a title and become an influencer today. Number three, we need to understand everything is changing and that includes communication. When it comes to getting your message out, don't just limit yourself to one form of communication. Mature leaders commit themselves to studying communication and learning a variety of avenues in order to maximize their effectiveness. Consider getting your message out on all social media platforms in addition to Sundays. Meetings and trainings don't have to be face-to-face. -face. Think about having conference call trainings or Zoom meetings. Listen, the possibilities are endless. The whole point is to broaden your reach and getting your message heard by broadening the way you use communication. And number four, Understand that you are not alone. So take advantage of community. Pick a great conference to go to at least once a year, like Kidman Nation Megacon. Children's ministry conferences are great ways to connect with like-minded Kidman leaders like you. So be uplifted, encouraged, and grow together with children's ministry leaders from all over the world. Also, consider other free resources that have been created to help you succeed. Have you subscribed to Ryan Frank's YouTube channel? It's chock full of videos to help you succeed in children's ministry and beyond. So get connected, grow, and stay in community. Hey, this is Esther Moreno signing off. And remember, families, children, and leaders can be reached. You have been appointed for such a time as this to reach them effectively. Believe in yourself. I believe in you. You got this. Have a great day, guys.